Scorpio, what's up? Welcome to your reading. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, Scorpio. So overall, I am getting you as being extremely dominating in this connection right now. All right, you're being an introvert. All right, I feel all this while here, you were probably taking the risk and trying to, you know, pursue this connection. Now there is a lack of confidence from your side. Okay, you're lacking the security. Okay, there is no security in this connection is what I'm getting here from this person out here. Okay, and uh, you've just completely withdrawn your energies, pulled away your energies from this person. You could be very busy, uh, you know, multitasking or just not focused on this at all right now. But this could be you. This could be the person you're dealing with also. All right. It could also be your person out here who lacks the confidence to come, to come towards you. Okay. This person out here is probably just trying to, you know, uh, you know, bully you or, you know, not literally bullying you, but they're trying to get an upper hand by trying to play games with you and, you know, trying to see if you come to them. Now, what I'm getting here is that your know, their overall energy out here, this person here sees what's going on in the connection. All right. If this person here had to make a choice or had to make a decision here all this while here, they're finally making a decision. They're finally opening the blindfold and seeing things for what it is because they realized that things were unfinished between you both right they do feel very very guilty and this person wants to make a comeback around the problem here is that they're not sure if you will take them back because for you it was definitely a connection where there was a fallout okay there was a breakup out here although you would want this happily ever after with this person out here um it looks like you're just coming up as someone here who's more uh, focused on themselves okay you're focused on yourself you're focused on your work your career your goals but at the same time out here you want something which is a full-time investment all right you want something that leads to stability security commitment out here but <clears throat> someone out here is constantly making the wrong choice okay either this person is running from commitment or they just probably have a very active dating life and they're not being able to give you a priority or not being able to prioritize where you fall um, in their life let's see let's see let's clarify <clears throat> clarify the card please let's clarify the cards this is for Scorpio So, like I said, right, this person out here, whoever's lacking confidence, right, this person out here is kind of, you know, wanting to make you an offer. They want to make you a stable, grounded offer out here. But it's that confidence, you know, that, that misses to push things to the next level. So, there's no action right now. They are very attracted to you, okay. They do see you as uh, someone they have unfinished business with, okay. And they know that you probably are someone who has a lot of suitors, yeah. And they love that about you, they... They, they, they love how badass you are you're bold brave you know and you just got the ball rolling all right you're not chasing you're attracting is what i'm getting now this person out here i'm seeing is wanting to return back to you you know you've been on your on their mind for a very long time and they've been thinking and thinking and thinking and thinking about what to do about this connection and finally they want to make a comeback around here okay either there's some truth that is wanting to be revealed to you or this person is coming back around here wanting a second chance okay they want to turn a new leaf out here now, all this while, I do feel this person out here was not making a decision, all right, because both the options were too good or too bad. Make it how it resonates. But I feel now this person out here is looking at the situation for what it is and they're okay to face the consequences out here because they want to set things right with you. Now, when it comes to you, I feel that you clearly see this as someone, you know, who probably just was with you for the uh, a physical aspect or just sexually interested in you and you've stopped investing into this connection okay you've completely withdrawn from this connection out here and you're just not putting in the nurturing energy and you're not putting in that um, focus you know you're just not wanting to nurture it anymore which is why there is a lack of growth and expansion out here or take it the other way that because there was no growth and expansion from this person's side or because the connection wasn't growing uh, due to lack of commitment out here you've completely pulled away <coughs> I feel you came off as very selfless person, okay, when it came to this person out here, you took off care of this person, like in a very nurturing way, you know, like always there for this person, forgiving this person over and over again. But you know what the problem is, Scorpio, I feel you forgot to set boundaries. You gave and gave and gave and gave, but you forgot to set boundaries, you forgot to add structure to the connection, which is why things went out of control and probably came to this point out here. Now, I feel 
one thing I'm seeing for sure is that this person out here and you both of y'all want a fairy tale ending with each other. You both want this happily ever after, all right, with each other out here. Now, there is an offer here, okay? There is an offer here that the person wants to make towards you, okay? They want to make you an offer here. But the problem here is there's a lot of confusion. Either this person here is... Uh, now, if they want to make you an offer, I don't feel this person has their options open, okay? I feel this person is very confused, okay? One, because they lack confidence. The second part, they don't know which is the best approach to make towards you, which I think I said before also. They don't know which is the right way to come towards you because you're coming off as very confident, okay? Very confident very grounded out here they do see you as marriage material and they want something uh long term with you here all right for sure <clears throat> this person out here uh is still going to waste a little bit of more time okay um because there is a delay here i see in the outcome all right this person here refuses to end things with you so what happens here is that they don't want to let you go they're coming back around here they refuse to end things out here with you, all right, because they don't want to let you go, like I said. But again, there is a certain change. There's a resistance, strong resistance from this person's side where they know that they need to make a few changes in themselves which need to die for good, okay, so that things can go on to the next level, all right, with you, so that this connection can grow. But that's something that they want to wait for. They want to wait. They ponder, 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 ponder. That's what they're doing. They're waiting for the right time or they're trying to keep things on hold out here till they're not ready to make a move forward or till they're not ready to take the next steps out here, okay. So neither are they letting you go nor are they making a step ahead, okay. So that's like quite um, screwed up. Now, I do feel here that there is a lot of feelings and a lot of emotions that this person has for you, okay? And uh, this person is realizing how much they love you, okay? But there is this sense of fear. There's a sense of anxiety. There's this unknown energy out here where they don't really know what's going on in the connection because I'm assuming there is no uh, communication between you both here. So whatever's happening here is creating a lot of fear in this person's mind, okay? And this person out here is just waiting for the wheel to turn in their favor. They're waiting for the right time. It's like they're waiting for an opportunity, okay, to come their way so that there can be clarity out here. But till that opportunity doesn't come their way or till the universe doesn't go there and give them an opportunity, like, hey, that's the opportunity. Now is the right time to go and approach Scorpio. Uh, the road's clear. Till then, they would just want to hold on to their intuition here and not really do much, okay? I feel they're very indecisive right now. You know, like I said, Seven of Cups, Moon here, there's too much of confusion here and uh, there's probably too much of, uh, you know, uh, dreams build in the air. All the castles are being built in the air. Okay, nothing grounded into reality here. It's all because nothing's clear. Okay, this person has no idea about the future of the connection. They don't know what you feel. You know, they don't know what to make of the situation. They don't know what to think. Okay, so they're waiting for their opportunity here is what I'm getting. <clears throat> I feel that uh, this person here does know Somewhere, somehow this person knows that they want long-term commitment with you. They know that you are the one that they want. They know that they want to marry you. But it's like they have an idea about how to approach this, but they're lacking the motivation. They're being indecisive because they don't know how to uh, execute it, okay? It's like there's this lack of execution coming from this person's side, okay? The offer is wanting to be made, okay? So they're sure about you being the one, okay? They know that you are the one that they want. They know they messed up, okay? And now they realize your value, all right? They know they're guilty. They're wanting to set things right between you both here. But they're just, like I said, there is a big opportunity that could be coming your way or they're just waiting for the right opportunity, okay, uh, to clear <clears throat> uh, whatever's happened between you both. Because something shifted, all right, something shifted and this person does not has no idea about why it went wrong, okay. So there is a little waiting period here. This person needs a little more time to think about, you know, while they're making you wait, you may feel that there's no movement going on behind the scenes here, but there's a lot going on behind the scenes, okay? With the hangman here, I feel that even though the connection is stagnant out here, this person is trying their best to change the way they look at the connection. They're changing their perspective while making you wait, okay? So you may feel that there's nothing happening out here, but actually there's a lot happening. This person out here does see you as marriage material. You know, they see you as their spouse. For some of you, you could already be married to this person and they want to make things right between you both. But uh, they're just not ready to execute the idea, okay? Again, I'm getting that lack of confidence out here too, all right? They don't have the courage yet because they, um, um, 
they feel you're just too good for them i feel this person here sees you as doing very well you know and uh you don't really give a shit for them all right which is making them feel even more insecure like the scorpio just move on without getting a closure or the scorpio even miss me the scorpio even remember me the scorpio even want me what does scorpio feel for me you know like talk to me is what they're saying like talk to me give me away i feel you don't care you know that's what they feel they feel you don't care they feel you're very happy where you are all right but yeah the offer they're ready they they plan what they have to give you they plan what their investment is in you it's just um um it's just going to be a little bit of waiting period till the time they come towards you with that communication which will lead to something good okay but there's a little more waiting period before this person comes in okay so that's what i have for you scorpio hope this reading resonates and like share subscribe and i'll see you next time bye bye